On April 24th, a stock trader on the Blind Online Community, an anonymous platform for hashtag verified our score employees to candidly share about their careers, workplaces, and companies, revealed a detailed timeline of Min Heejin's time with Source Music and a door under High B. But the one thing Bang Si Yuk failed to do was create a successful girl group, so he acquired Source Music, which had successfully launched the popular girl group G Friend. At the same time, he recruits Min Hee Jin, who is a creative director, to Source Music. Min Hee Jin has been renowned for making contributions to K-pop with her unique art visuals and concepts seen through SM artists, including Girls' Generation, F of X, Red Velvet, EXO, Shiny, and more. During this time, with Min Hee Jin joining the team, Source Music actively moved ahead with launching a new girl group. They started global auditions to select members for new jeans, starting off with Minji on September 4th, 2019. The entertainment industry seemed to take a back step with COVID, but Big Hit did not stop there and strengthened its determination by acquiring Pletus Entertainment, known for 17, and aiming for an autumn listing, launching an IPO and going public. On 2020, May 25th, BTS reached number one on the Billboard Hot 100 for the first time with Dynamite. On 2020, August 21st. Finally, in October, Big Hit Entertainment led a significant surge. After the IPO, it rose to become an entertainment company worth around 11 trillion Korean won, 8 billion US dollars. On 2020, October 15th. Big Hit requests Min Hee Jin for a company rebranding, and they change the company name to HYB, becoming a global entertainment company with a multi-label system. 2021, March 10th. The main issue of contention between Min Hee Jin and Bang Si Hyuk began in 2021 when Min Hee Jin stated, I want to debut new jeans through my own solo label, not under source music. Bang Si Hyuk invested 16.1 billion KRW, 11.7 million US dollars, 100% capital provided by HYB, into a new subsidiary called ADOR, established through a physical division from Source Music. He promised Min Hee Jin an annual salary of 500 million KRW, 370,000 US dollars, and a future exercisable ADOR stock option of 20%. Then, she took Minji, Hani, Danielle, and Heron, who had been preparing as trainees under Source Music, to ADOR. On 2021, November 12th, after Min Hee Jin left Source Music, the company experienced significant staff losses. To counter this, they recruited Kim, Che Won, and Sakura on March 14th, 2022, and debuted the girl group Les Seraphim. 2022, May 2nd. Although ADOR partially covered the training costs for the Source Music trainees, they did not fully compensate for the training period and the staff losses. Adair debuted new jeans with Hyun on July 22nd, 2022, achieving record-breaking first-week sales for a girl group. 2022, July 22nd. 2023. Adair's financial success continued as its sales surged from 18.6 billion KRW, 13.5 million USD, in 2022 to 110.3 billion KRW, 80 million USD, in 2023. In an attempt to fulfill earlier promises, Bang Si Hyuk tried to offer Min Hee Jin 20% ownership in stock options. However, she demanded more due to a 45% tax rate at the acquisition point. Ultimately, Bang provided her with 18% ownership through low price stocks instead of options. According to a HANA Securities report at the time, Adair was valued at 2 trillion KRW, 1.5 billion USD, and Min Hee Jin received compensation nearing 400 billion KRW, 290 million USD, by the end of 2023. Tensions escalated by the end of 2023 as Min Hee Jin began negotiations with major global investors like the Saudi Sovereign Wealth Fund and the Singapore Investment Corporation to secure a larger stake. She aimed to persuade HYB, which owns 80% of ADOR, to sell more than 30% of its stake, 
seeking a stake of over 50% to own management rights of ADOR with the support of these investors. Min Hee-jin is also accused of using underhanded tactics, such as leaking HYB artists' personal information and manipulating the families of New Jeans members to pressure HYB. Legal guardians of New Jeans members asked for clarifications on allegations of HYB copying their style with Illid, but refused to take a meeting, citing distrust in HYB's intentions. Frustrated, Bang Si Hyuk accepted a market capitalization loss of 850 billion KRW, 618 million USD, and initiated an audit.